Okay, Reapings here, everybody. Welcome back to Serious Cooper's Adventures in God of War. Last episode, we met Brock, who is a merchant and a, well, kind of blacksmith, I suppose. And he upgraded our axe and also Atreus's bow, which is cool. So they can, they're a little bit stronger now. Uh, oh, this is where we looked through before from the other side there. Interesting. So this, I don't think this is the place I thought it was last time. Anyway. I'm sure we'll figure it out eventually. Can we like... Do something about these? No? Okay. That's fine. Alright, so we have... It looks like options, maybe? There's a chain to go this way. There is something here. And yeah, this leads... I think this leads to the place I was hoping to get to last episode. We ha there was like a chest behind another gate. Down there. And this looks like it may maybe lead there. Yeah, 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 it does. To find Sweet. A road. I did. People are one thing. Everything else you fight. Until I say stop or we are dead. Understand? Pull your weight or we go home. I understand. Good then. Okay. A little bit uh, grumpy at him. Now, why should I go this way? Question mark. Should I go this way or should I just climb back up? I mean, there's no reason to go this way right now, is there? It's probably just smarter to go back up here, because we want to stay... Oh, wait, were we not able to cross the the bridge? Let me double check. Because we jumped over the bridge here, but maybe we can't actually get up there. No, we can. It's all good. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe oh. it would trigger something. It was nice meeting you, Bob. I'll be thinking of a name for your beast. How about I name her fucking gratitude? <laughs> hey, fucking gratitude, come over here. I like it. He's the best. Man, these characters in this game so far are pretty interesting. We only met two strangers so far, right? And they're both, they're both were pretty awesome and funny. Hey, what's your hinds in there? That place can bust you up real good. Okay. Uh... Well... I'm still wondering, like, well, I guess we're gonna be locked in here too, right? Uh, now we can get out again. Is this the actual pass? Is there a way for us to see which pass we have to take? Because this goes to the mountain, but there was also, like, the outside area. Hmm, maybe let me go check the other way first. So maybe this is the actual pass to take. I wish there was a better indication of, like, you know, what's the... What's the story passes so I can avoid it as much as possible and explore. Okay, there's a bloody rock or something. Ooh, that was the gate closing, right? That little rump. I think so. Yeah, let's go this way first. This is probably oh, one of those artifacts. The face of magic. Yeah, mass found. Uh, is this something we've been to? Yes, we have. Okay. And then this... May actually be a dead end. Yeah, I guess it is. Alright, cool. So, good thing I came back to this area. And this bloody rock, though, seems a bit suspicious, but... Hmm. I'm not sure. You know, I was actually thinking, like, now that I was edited the first episodes and stuff. That little blue seal we've seen at the door that we couldn't open. It's for, like, these hidden rooms. I wonder now if you could have punched it because it's like the same kind of blue that these revenants that we can't kill with our axe have. I wonder if punching would have done anything. I don't think I tried that. But, uh, or maybe it's just something for the future, who knows. Just setting it up, especially if you can travel back. Can go through here. Yeah, this looks a bit dangerous though. Ooh, this is like golden scribbled? Or is this just like wood? What is that? Why is it all shiny? This way. Okay. But pulling it out does not pull it back. Strange. Multiple times, maybe? Yes. Let's hope it doesn't close on us and kill us. Seems good. What is this? This is super uh, suspicious. That looks inviting. Oh. Ah. Uh, is it behind here? Yeah, it is behind here. How do I pull this back? 
Oh, look at this. Ha <laughs> ha. Nice. Nice little secret. Soft steel. I'm guessing there might be different types of steels. But for now, I'm just gonna skip that very complicated word in between. Okay. So we have something we can spin there. A platform that leads into death. And a few people tried it already. This is red rune. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. That might just be decoration though. So let's just see what happens if I do this. Okay. But how do we get over? We probably have to do this a few times. Oops. To get it like way up there. Oh crap. There we go. Okay, so that was stuck. Oh, the, the spikes are gone here now Wait too. There. Okay. Ooh, can we like hunt push these like into the wall or something? Yeah, you can definitely like steer which way you want to like stomp them on. No fire! I forbid to fire! Alright. Oh, there's more. There's always more! Ouch! I touched the spikes. It looked like there was someone... Yeah, it's wrong stuff. Guess I need to help you, huh? Nope, shit. And to the left. There we go. Didn't quite hit him though. The strong attack pushes them a little bit too much. Probably shouldn't do that on those guys. More? Yes. Oh, you're a big one. You're a big one. Yeah, I should do the push. I guess I still have my shield too, right? Oh man, punching is really good against those. Uh, what was that? Oh, it was like... Okay, that was, that was not an insta-kill. Interesting. So I can like pull him and then steer. Try to <laughs> throw him into the spikes. I guess that's not a finisher or anything. Oh. Is that a laugh? Oh, I guess I could have just pulled the axe too, maybe, and like crushed him, but that was more fun. Okay, hack silver. Um, yeah, so I don't want to, you know, pull out the axe right now, probably. Or do I? Let's see. There are runes too. Is there any safe spot though? Hmm. Okay, I need to open this. Now, boy. Whew. Okay, it's a little bit scary. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay. Whew. <laughs> a little bit close there. I want to. Shit. Didn't quite get it. Oh, I did get it, okay. Where were, where were the other ones though? There was one... No, that's two... Where are the other two? Let's have a look around before, like, let's drop. Don't see it up there. Oh, my nose is so itchy. It's annoying. Uh, that's just a shield. That might be on top of this thing. Oh, wait, did I see it there? Something shiny. That might be a rune. Is there something from here, from this direction? No. It, was, it still might be there though, but maybe we have to let it like lower down first. You probably don't even have to do it like this. You can probably like do this from here, no? Maybe I did it just really complicated. I don't know. Let's see. Okay. 
Okay. Yeah, I guess we can probably stand on this. Wasn't sure we're gonna get oh. out of there. There's one. I will not let us die. And that laugh makes me think there's a revenant. Yeah, I think that's a rune there. Yeah. How would I get this one though? Uh, do I need to be at like a weird angle or something? Or is it from the other side? Or can I get high? Oh! Oh, I see, I see, I see. Like this. And actually, we can probably... We might be able to like, blow ourselves all the way up. Who knows? Okay, fancy chest again. The apple. No, there's something else. Horn of blood meat. Legendary. You have collected one of three horns of blood meat. Needed to increase your maximum rage. Awesome. Blood meat is a red drink that makes one's rage run deeper. Find the nine total horns in the world and chest locked by magic. Every three you collect will increase your maximum rage. Okay. Can increase it up to three times. Cool. Yeah, so we can go this way, but like, is there any reason for us to like pull us all the way up maybe uh, I don't see like a hallway or anything so probably not it might not even be possible uh, okay but so like there's a way this way and this way right so I don't again don't know which way to go first it's always a problem I guess check this one first I'm giving I'm guessing one of those uh, laughing things was like that that like uh, what would I call Reavers that flying lady Oh, Revenant. Yeah, yeah, they are called Revenant. Okay. That's what I thought at first. Um, oh, and this just goes down again? Why, though? Nah, I don't think we need to. Alright, let's go back here. This way. Yes. Yes, indeed. Up we go. Oh, he's running to the cliff again. Never been this close to the mountain before. Looks so big. I wish Mom was here to see it. Just do it, man. Oh. <laughs> Come, boy. Ooh, look at that statue over there, though. Fancy. Looks very interesting. There's more here, too. It looks like blood or something. Yeah, it's like blood sacrifices. Or something, I don't know. Another artifact. Ooh, good find. Thank you. Alright. Let's go look around. Just try to fix my... Hey, look at that. ...fan. Boy. Look, there are runes written along the side. Yeah. What does it say? As we are, we two, we three. As I alone can never be. A riddle. Hmm. Maybe there's a clue around here. Okay. Well, we see two statues. I'm guessing there's going to be a third one. It also looks like it's going to be like one of those puzzles where you have to arrange those circles, you know, to match up. Seems like maybe those rings should be turning. Yeah, that's what I just said, boy. Okay. Looks like we have to use our axe to do that. Now, do we have to do it in a specific order or do we just stop them? Yes. Okay. We do have to do it in a specific order. Uh, that, yeah, I know. I'm <laughs> working on it. Be quiet, son. Oh, boy. Uh, let's try... Yep. Yeah. And then only the middle one. If I get a chance again. Come on. Come on, spinny thing. Don't be shy. Do it 180 for me, please. And... Rooms. 
boy. What do those runes say? Oh, it says family. That's not a clue. It's the answer. What I alone can never be. Right? Use your knife and trace the runes into the sand. Really? Kinslow. Damn, that's fancy. Something happened! Oh god! Stash is looking at me. This is the never ending story after all. Are they gonna like follow me? No, right? Are they gonna shoot a beam? No, okay. Spooky! Oh, wait. Almost missed that. Almost missed that. It was only hack silver, it was not a artifact though. Okay. Well, let's go inside. I wonder who built this. Probably, it looks like elven stuff, I'm right? Happy with my broth, but I'm happy we're leaving this place. It is behind us now. So you're going this way. So I'm gonna go this way. I don't even know if there would be elves or something in this, you know? Like, is that part of Nordic <laughs> mythology? Probably, I don't, probably not. I don't know. I actually don't know. Okay, four more. Uh, is there anything else up here then? I'm really... Uh, just some stuff, boy. Boy. I don't know if these like symbols have anything to mean or any meaning. Probably not. Just some drawings. Break this pot! Okay, it has health. What is that? Is that a crow? Do I hear a crow? Also, there's a pot here. I got it. What are you talking about? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. These are gonna be really difficult to find, aren't they? Jesus. <laughs> I mean, I heard it like barely, but like, you know, barely. Okay. Well, again. I like that we can come back, which I'm just assuming at this point still, but Boy, if we can, that's gonna be fun. These tracks. Hmm. A boar maybe? Not sure. But I'll find it. Go. Okay. It is important for a warrior to keep his skills sharp. Ooh, look at this place. It's like a swampy place. Are we gonna lose our horse in the swamp? I'm just gonna assume this game is the never ending story. Okay. It's another troll. A fiery one. Uh, he doesn't care about that. Ouch. Does he have ammo? No, it does do damage. Oh, we have ants! I just noticed that. Yeah, trying to avoid it. Oh, there's water here too. Probably in case I get set on fire, I can like... Ow! Extinguish myself there. Just do that. Nice! Try to use the big one at the end. Oh, he's still stunned or something. I wonder if I can push him. No, that water... That fire is not getting away from me. Oh boy, oh boy. It's a lot of fire. Ooh, hey. That's gonna make it easy, isn't it? Oh, snap. That's poison. I thought maybe like rolling in, wa in water would get rid of it. Doesn't seem like it does. Still curious if you could push him into that pond. Didn't do it right though. Ouch. Are you okay? Sure. 
Oh, there we go. Well, that was a bit more interesting. Hey, it's like that Thor hammer thing. That's weird. Does that mean something? Uh, Ivaldi's anvil, heavy runic attack, a devastating area of effect that freezes all enemies caught in the blast. Okay. Oh, he's dead. Oh no, there's another one. How can I not avoid these? I'm so bad at avoiding things. I tried to dodge to the side, but that wasn't really the side, was it? I just use him to like interrupt them, shouldn't I? That's just something I need to get used to, like using him more. All right, cool. Uh, Bren Brenna Dowdy or Douthy. Again, I'm not sure how to pronounce these. This is the second troll we've seen so far. I had no idea they were so close to our house. They've never bothered us before, but I guess we never bothered them uh, either. Mother said if I ever saw a troll, I should run the other way. Uh, I guess she never said that to father. Okay. Yeah, it almost looked like that the way he died was similar to that, like, story thing we've seen, you know? With Thor, Shadow. These were human reavers, but now that they've embraced the ways of the Sadie or something, they can throw magic spells at a distance. Here, what does it say? Nor near. Fate. No good comes from them. Okay. Does that mean it's a bad chest? Where's the last one? Is this one where you have to like do it quickly? Yeah, you do. I figured as much. Uh, is this like save? <laughs> okay, before we do anything, let's before I forget here, let's install this rune. So frost goes up, cooldown sixty seconds, and this one is with L one and R two, so it's like the heavy attack. All right, I guess I'll do it. I mean, might as well. And we could upgrade it to increase the frost by one, two. This one increases stun by two. That's actually pretty good. Oh yeah, and I never checked out the skills. We had more skills here now. And maybe something else we should unlock. After landing a precision axe throw, weak points and headshots, press triangle doing a flash to recall the leviathan axe and cause an extra or melee attack to explode on contact. Hmm. Uh, what is this? Aim and hold R2 to charge up the Leviathan Axe and cause an explosion on impact that inflicts frost damage. It sounds good. I don't know how strong it is, though. It seems to hit the neighbors, the neighboring ones, too. Uh, while sprinting, press R1 to perform a leaping attack. Ooh, this might be good. Because like, closing in on enemies is something I want. Um... Perform attacks in quick succession without sustaining damage. Power up the Levi Leviathan Axe and inflict frost damage on every hit. Ooh. That seems super good. How many how many times do you have to hit, though? So you can see he's hitting like three times. Four, five, six, roughly. And then it starts without getting hit. While evading, press L forward and press R1 to perform a quick axe attack. While evading. Okay. Hmm. These all sound interesting to me. Uh, Rage Comet, I haven't really learned anything yet. We have these, right? Yeah. Uh, in Spartan Rage, press L1 to do a quick storm that damages and disrupts all enemies. Hold R1 to deliver a forceful haymaker that knocks enemies backwards at great speed. Or with the shield, while barehanded and evading, press L forward and press R1 to perform a quick attack. Wait, does that not conflict with the other one then? Uh, while evading, press forward and R1 to perform a quick axe attack. Oh, with your fist? While barehanded evading. I see, I see, I see. Double tap L1 to break an enemy's block. Ooh, that sounds good too. And then the bow. Increase arrow damage and melee damage. Increases the talons bow firing rate. Ha, huh, I don't know. There's some good ones here. I also kind of want to like, just get these basic ones. I think I may get this one, because I like the ones that are like passive, you know? This is like a passive thing we can 
constantly do. We don't have to actively... Um, a sealed chest. We don't have to actively, you know, do it. Oh, what's up there? Like, we don't have to use the skill. We can just, like, punch people. Oh, there it is. Okay. So, okay. Quick, quick, quick. While I'm recalling, I can't sprint. There we go. Quick before it, like, resets, maybe. Okay, another apple. We got three out of three now. Wow, that's quite a bit. It's like 50%. Awesome. Very cool. I'll just punch these. We don't need to, but let's just do it anyway. Did I grab that rage? Yeah, we used it at the end, didn't we? Okay, let's have a look around a little bit. There's something to climb here too. Another chest. Yeah, I'm really wondering if there's something you can do while you're on fire. I thought, you know, I was really sure that maybe you could just run into the water, because why... I don't know, I feel like this is why there's water here, right? Maybe I wasn't deep enough, or maybe it did reduce it quicker or something. I didn't see if it was, like, reducing it faster or something, the fire debuff. Hmm. I have to see while I'm editing the videos. Is this a piece? Nope, that's hex silver. And I guess it's all up here, right? All there is. This game makes me wish to have like a PS4 Pro so I could get that 60 frame per second. That would be awesome because this is 30 frames per second right now. But like in games like these, you know, fighting and evading things and stuff, it's kind of nice to have um, 60 frames. Is this the way boy, forward? Are you your animal ahead? Oh yeah. I knew it was a boy. No, no, come back, come back. No animal hunting right now. We are treasure hunting. Okay, let's go up here. Let's see what that weird wall is. And there's also a chain. Come, boy. Boy, I need your help. Come over here. Boy. Boy. <laughs> Are you coming? Can you... Is this, is this not one where you, like... Where you're gonna, like, help me climb? Oh, maybe... Wait, I have to destroy this one. And then you can do it. Okay. Got it. Chains, please. You know, these kind of like segments, technically, if you think about this, right, just from like a logic point of view, these make no sense. Or not, not in like logical, that wasn't the right word. I don't know what the word is, but like gameplay wise, we didn't do anything. There's no difference in us pushing him up here and then him lowering this. Compared to, like, just having this here, right? Like, th there was no gameplay element in between <laughs> having this rope down here. Other than that we pushed one button extra. And it makes him, like, climb up there. But it still kind of adds, like, a sort of story element to it, I suppose. Where, you know, they kind of work together. I don't know. Just random thoughts. Huh. Interesting. I may want to write that down. Okay. And it's gone. I hope you wrote it down. Because it's gone now. If not, we never know what it said. Prayer to Odin. Find here our sacrifice, mighty Alfather, and deliver Midgard from Hell's wild hunt. Odin, wisest of all, whose breath gave life to Ask and Embla, first among our people, we beg your protection. Send forth your noble Valkyries and Kal the Deathless. Send forth your noble sons, Thor and Baldur, uh, to shield us. Send forth dragons to consume the frigid horde. Save our souls that we may serve you evermore. I don't think Odin got the message, or he didn't care. Alright. Thor and Baldur. Hmm. Uh, can we get down here now? No, we can't even get through there. We're too fat for this. We have to take this. <laughs> okay, makes sense. Uh, but I think we're gonna... Oh. Okay, there was a way down there too, apparently. We're gonna continue next episode, or next time. I don't think there's anything else in this little area here. Looks like we have to go forward next. So, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. And I will see you guys soon. Bye-bye. Forward. Dear what? Forward. I don't know.